This is pretty cool. We got geese at the pond. That's why we got to get rid of the coyotes. Don't want to bother them geese. Well, guys, down here on location, taking out the trash. And if I don't take out these critters, messed up all my sets here. Um, as you can see in the earlier video, we have a nesting pair of geese up at the pond and if we don't take out these nest eaters we won't have any geese at the pond this guy would love to go in and eat those geese eggs we're gonna freshen up our scents a little bit here I just don't know about this peat moss stuff. Because as you can tell, it cracks up the sets. Wow. Sure dug that one out, didn't it? Which the nine and three don't work for me. My trap is right there. And as you can see, they come in from behind and dig it out. They kind of always come in from the side or behind. Well, great. Okay, here's my remakes. See, I'm in a catch circle. It's really hard to blend that back in, but... My trap's right there in the middle. I've got fried chicken on either side and ground um, turkey, I think it is. No, no, pork. I don't know, ground up something that's fixing to expire. So we got that set. We got this tri set over here with the scent post. Um, not even gonna try and blend those in any better. But under that pile of duff right there, there's all kinds of bait. Here's our catfish bait. Here's our ground pork. Some old ground up something. I think that's my homemade. Yeah, that's, that's deer. See the way it's dried out. And underneath of here, we have a bunch of fried chicken. Got fried chicken bones. And you can see this is a remnant of a catch circle. We got feces right there. So we got some bones there, and I filled that hole up. This one here is the one that keeps coming from behind every day. They run up right along here and dig it out here. My trap is right there. And they're coming in here. And I was expecting them to come through here, but they're not. They're coming through here, right along this edge, and digging that out. We do got some scattered turkey from Thanksgiving leftover or something like that scattered through all over there. We got some gland lure on a Q-tip there. But if you watch the video, what he's going to do is he's going to come in here, run along the backside here. And he'll dig this out to get to the bait. But anyways, thanks for some pretty video. So back here we got where we had the possum. I don't have a sifter with me. That's all I'm doing. It's fixing to rain any minute. And that's all I'm going to do. There's our camera setups. Over here. turkey laying around, some ground pork, there's a blind set right there in that mess, there's another one over here, but they don't like this guiding, they come from behind and dig it out, and they really don't like this cubby set, they'll dig in from behind, but there's what's left of the carcass in there, so I'm going to see what happens, but if you watch the video, they come they come in through all this thick stuff and sneak up behind it and pull it all back out. 
So, if you're afraid he's guiding, but yet they're walking through that mess. So I'm going to change my cards and going to get out of here.